Hey, it's Jennifer from Happiness is Homemade For, and welcome to my channel. All right, y'all, today's Dollar Tree haul is going to be for all those wonderful men in our lives. I'm talking husbands, dads, brothers, sons. I mean, any man in your life that you buy for. So I know Dollar Tree sometimes can be a little bit tricky putting gift sets together for the guys. Uh, women were easy. <laughs> guys, sometimes it's a little more difficult. So I got a bunch of stuff here. I'm not going to spend a lot of time because I know I can be a talker. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on each thing because I have a lot of stuff for you. A lot of different ideas. We're going to group it together. And at the end, um, we'll either like put a basket together or I'll do a basket and then show you. So Riley and I went to Dollar Tree and we, y'all, I had a cart full. <laughs> I was embarrassed to go to the checkout lane. All right, enough of me rambling. All right, so our first basket that we'll kind of do is like the hygiene. Uh, just like the smell good kind of stuff. Um, great little finds at Dollar Tree, seriously. So first thing I grabbed, they had dad socks. Look how cute these are. Um, if you're a husband, dad, whoever has to dress up for work every day, maybe church on Sundays, some little dress, <laughs> some little dress socks. How cute, number one dad. A loofah. Grab me a loofah. We all use them. It's a loofah. I also grabbed this power stick three in one men's, um, it's men's body wash, shampoo, conditioner, spring fresh. Um, and it smells, it smells really good. Riley liked this scent, so we grabbed it, um, because, you know, they're gonna be using it around here. <laughs> so these right here also kind of match this. All right, our spring. It's a classic and it smells wonderful. And look how good that looks together. So some Irish spring soap and it's a two pack. So that, also same brand, Power Stick. They have face and body wipes. You have the green scent, which is spring fresh. And then you also have cool blue water, which is that one right there. And you get 30 wipes in each one. Um, if they happen to go to the gym before or after work, they can kind of wipe up clean. You know, if they work like in construction, a factory, wherever. You know, we all use these kind of wipes. <laughs> so I grabbed those. They had a men's grooming kit. Um, Assured for Men is the brand. But look at that. That is really nice. You get a comb, some little ce scissors. Ha! <laughs> scissors! Um, a nail clipper and some tweezers because even men they can get a little unibrow. They can pluck a couple of hairs So that right there and even for you, this is a great little find so That I and mean, you may be getting a glare, but right there that. All right. They also had a pocket knife. Look at this Look how great that is any man anybody can keep one of these they can throw in their pocket glove compartment of their car that's nice to have. Um, it is a eight in one multi-use knife. It's got scissors, a can opener, a bottle opener, a flat screwdriver, a Phillips screwdriver, a nail file, and a corkscrew. I mean, a lot of these could really come in handy. That right there. All right, this right here, every man needs one of these. <laughs> it's a nose hair uh, trimmer. Nose and ear hair trimmers right here. Y'all, Barbasol, that's a name brand. $1.25 for this. So uh, <laughs> let's do a little maintenance. So that is a great fun. They had Be Pure Shave Soap. Look at that. And I love the guy in the front. He's got a big old beard, just like my husband. So this right here, I guess you just... You lather, you know, just like soap, you lather it up, but it says you shave with this. So I guess instead of shaving cream, they could try that. But I thought this would look great and kind of like high-end looking in a gift basket. That. Also, speaking of beards, they have a beard trim, a beard trimming cape. Y'all, <laughs> my husband, he's got a big beard. I love it. But the clippings, like when he trims it up, goes all into the sink, and he wipes it up somewhat. There's always little hairs. Drives me nuts. So this right here, it goes around them, and then it's supposed to suction cup to the mirror. 
So that way they can stick it to the mirror and it loops down like this and now the trimmings are supposed to go into that cape. <laughs> so I thought that was a really neat find. Then I found the brand, The Nobleman. I don't know what that is. Uh, it says um, Global Beauty Care, New York, New York. But they have, what's this? It is retinol eye serum with retinol and peptides. I mean, even guys, <laughs> you know, there's a lot of guys out there that do a lot of like facial care, um, moisturize. We all need a little moisturizing to our face. So this, and then they had cucumber under eye pads with um, vitamins A, C, and E. <laughs> I don't know if my husband will use this, but I thought it was a great find, and who knows? If he don't use it, I can. So, those two, once again, very, like, very nice looking for a gift basket. Those. Um, okay. Crest 3D Whitening Toothpaste. So, name brand find, once again, just add it to their gift basket. Um, chapstick. Blistex name brand chapstick. Then I found, and I thought this was a great idea for anybody. Um, I'm going to put one in both of our bathrooms. This is a PVC soap saver. Now look at this. It's a two pack, so you get two in here. Um, whatever material this is, I don't even know what this material is, but it feels almost kind of like rubbery to where, like this hour spring, your bar soap, you put it on here and it just sits on here in the shower. You know, because sometimes like in the shower, you'll get like that soap, like the bar soap, like that residue, like wherever it touches. So I guess it sits on here. But I thought that was a great find. Now, this right here, I love. Look at this um, toiletry bag. Is that what it's called? Men's travel bag. This is really nice. Look how nice this is. It's got the little handle. Like, you know, if they're traveling, maybe for work, or you're going on vacation, we go camping. So, let's open this up. Um, wow, look at that. That is really, that's a really nice size. Wow, I love that. And they had different, um, like, colors and prints. They also had, like, a camo one. But I just grabbed this one for him. And you can use this as your gift basket. Open this up, put like a lot of this good stuff in here and like a little um, shred or some gift or tissue paper. And we'll do that, I'll show you that too. But I think this is really nice. All right, also name brand. They had Freeman for men, pore cleansing peel off gel mask. That's a really nice find. And even if you get it for him and he don't like it, <laughs> you could use it. But look at that. Uh, I think it's charcoal. Is it charcoal? No, it just says pore cleansing volcanic, volcanic, volcanic ash. Is that. They had razors. Look at this kit right here. I just thought this looked really nice. Right there. Um, You get one handle and three cartridges. Rubber grip, lubricating strip, stainless steel blades, assured for men. They also had power stick shave cream with aloe vera. Right there. And I grabbed this because it had all like that same, the greenery. They also had, y'all, this is a huge name brand find. They had Centrum Men um, Multivitamins in their gummies. Now, <laughs> it says men 50 and over, and Riley was like, Mom, that is not 50. I said, oh, he's close enough. <laughs> he's like, you would be mad if someone bought you 50 and over. I'm like, I know, but your dad don't care. <laughs> but it says men 50 and over, multi-gummies. So, I grabbed this. Now, they do have like a smaller one, like for men, um, but I already have that one. So, there is a men's out there. But this is mid, <laughs> men's 50 and over. And then like for something for these right here, a tote caddy. 
Look at this. A tote caddy comes in black and white. I grabbed this black one. This is really nice too. You could put all the gifts inside of here. Yeah, so I really like this. I got this because when I'm done with it, I can use this in our kitchen to keep all my cleaning supplies in. That, that way I can grab it and kind of like carry it around with me. That one. All right, so that was like the health, like men's hygiene stuff. All right, so my next idea was like car washing stuff. Because I know there's a lot of guys out there, and women too, who just really enjoy spending the weekend washing and waxing and stuff their cars. So I found this big car washing sponge. Look at that. That is really nice and a great size. I mean, look at the thickness of that right there. So I got one of these. All right, so I know at my stores, Dollar Tree does not carry this year round. I guess they just bring it out like around the summertime. Look. It's one of those car windshield cover things, like to protect your car from the heat. Um, and if you have leather seats, the heat can crack your seats over time. So this right here, um, Armor All, huge name brand, disinfectant wipes for your car. That is a great find. Uh, does it say how many you get? 10 wipes, so 10 wet wipes They're right there. This is great, and it um, also comes in blue, but it's a microfiber wash mitt. So you can put your hand in here, almost like it's a mitten, like a glove, and wash your car with it. And um, two, it says use wet or dry. Like if you're doing like your dashboard or something, put this on like a mitt and clean your dashboard with it. That. They had a handy chamois. <laughs> Look at that! This is great for drying your car. Once you wash it and you don't want like the sun to dry spots all over it, this holds up to five times its weight in liquid. So this, I actually probably should grab a couple of these because these are really nice to have. And once again, my stores do not carry this year round. All right, more. Name brand Armor All Finds. Disinfectant spray. So it comes in a spray. Ultra Shine Spray Wax, and these are four ounces. Get that right there. And then they also had a multi-purpose auto cleaner. So I guess this would be like your dashboard, maybe your console. So that right there. Yep, seriously, these right here, name, brand, would be a great gift basket filler. That. Um, I feel <laughs> I seriously feel like every guy that I know loves the black trees, car fresheners. I don't know what it is, but they all love it. This is like all their favorites. Like, like I said, the guys that I know. <laughs> so, Little Trees, huge name brand. It's been around for as long as I can remember. But black ice. You only get one though. All right, this right here is a repeat buy for us. This is automotive cleaning wipes, and you get 60. Right here, um, easy car care, exterior and interior surface cleaner. I just do like my dashboard of my car, but once again, great gift. All right, so you may hear, you may hear Bailey whining. She's sitting right here. <laughs> because we have a squirrel in the bird feeder. Also, Armor All, um, all purpose car wash and look how big this is. This is a good size for name brand at Dollar Tree. So got that right there. This is 10 ounces. That. This right here I thought was great. Um, Refresh is the brand. Refresh your car. Odor Eliminator Activated Charcoal Pouch. You get one, so there's one pouch in here and this is good for inside your car, in their trunk, Kind of wherever. Also, you can probably put this in a closet. That. And of course, you gotta have the classic <laughs> car wash bucket. Y'all, you know, these are great. I mean, I use one of these to mop our floors. It's a great bucket for washing your car and put all this stuff down in here. Add some tissue paper, some filler, maybe like a big saran, one of those clear bags, and make a really cute gift basket with this. All right, so our next gift basket idea is like the tools automotive section of Dollar Tree. Now, I feel like no matter who you are, you need some tools in your life. <laughs> so I was able to find some name brand finds 
which is, we'll start with that, they had Loctite. Light, Loctite is a huge name brand. They had Funtac paper, wood, towel, lino, linoleum, cinder block, brick, metal, plastic, glass, all kinds of stuff. It's mounting tabs. Removable, non-toxic. Does not say how many you get in here, but they're right there. Like I said, huge name brand to add to a gift basket. That. They also had Loctite Gel Super Glue. Those two. Safety glasses. No matter if they're like building something at home, cutting something, cutting up some wood. I'm more weed eating. You know, anything they do around the house. Some safety glasses, and they're so nice looking. Look at that. I'm gonna go ahead and open these up. Because I feel like no matter what, because I feel like these would look best in like a gift basket opened. Look at that. That is a really nice pair. And if you have one of those guys in your lives that loves to play like Nerf guns with the kids, they do paintball, any of that fun goofy stuff, some um, safety glasses are really nice. Shooting BB guns, you know, whatever. Like my husband and Riley, they'll go out into the backyard and they shoot BB guns. So some little safety glasses. I also grabbed um, the original Super Glue, huge name brand, been around forever, permanent mounting tape. So I figured that's a nice little thing to add to any, like, any toolbox. That. Uh, and it says it is four feet long. Right there. All right, this is a tool bench, which I believe is, you know, it's a Dollar Tree brand, but it's a 12-in-1 screwdriver set. Look at that. And it has all these different bits. See that? All those different bits to have. Y'all, <laughs> stuff like this is even good to keep in your car. Have you ever been out shopping somewhere and there was like a piece of furniture or something larger you wanted to buy, but you couldn't fit it into your car? If you had something like this in your car or an Allen wrench set, you can like take the legs off of it to get it into your car. I've done that before at Hobby Lobby. <laughs> so to me, this is great toolbox, a gift set. Keep it in your car. Right there. This I thought was a really neat idea. Um, it's an inspection mirror. Look at that. But it's telescopic. Look. Uh, okay, so that's as far as it goes. But right there, it's so if they're working on their car or they're trying to like fix or build something and they can't really get down in there and see, they can open that up. The little lens, like it bends. See that? You can bend it. So that way, if they're, say they are working on the car or like lawnmower or something, they can get down in there and try to see like if they're in the right spot. <laughs> Whatever, I don't know. But I just thought that was great. A level. Y'all, a level is great. <laughs> Even just if it's for you, keep this because when you're trying to hang a picture or something in your house, you can make sure that it's level and straight. And it's small, you know, that's the way it's easier to work with. Um, and it's magnetic. It's nine inches long and it's magnetic. Right there, that's a magnetic strip. Let's see, it's got a hanger hoe. If you wanna like cook this up and hang it in the garage or something. Um, it's got a top view, a 90 degree angle, a 180 degree angle, and a 45 degree angle, which are those different things right there. So. Zip ties. Zip ties, Dollar Tree, they come in black, clear. Uh, they have bigger ones, smaller ones, they have little ones. I asked Riley to grab the one that had black and clear in it, but <laughs> these are fun. Yeah, zip ties you can use for so many different things. All right, a really big name brand find at Dollar Tree's right now is the GRX um, gloves. There's different gloves right here. That's what it looks like. Oh, these are really nice. Um, professional Series GRX Dotted Breathable Nitrol. It's for plumbing, building materials, general tool use, garden, whatever. So those right there. Like I said, that's a name brand. Um, I saw medium, large, and extra large. 
And then they also had GRX Cut Series. That's right there. I love the coloring of these. This is cut resistant, durable, dipped coated palm, and it says automotive glass and bottle handling, warehouse and construction. So, so that is great. And it shows the guy uh, taking a knife to his finger. I don't recommend doing that, but it's supposed to be like, like it says, cut resistant. I just don't know like how much. All right, and then one of the things that I was the most excited for was tape measure. Y'all, they have the tape measures at Dollar Tree. And mind you, not carry these year round. I don't know why, but for Father's Day, they bring them out. But I have a great idea for these. Um, this sticker, like take that off. If you have a Cricut, um, a wood burning tool, and you have some little rounds, you could add something right there. You could put, um, Dad, I love you beyond measure. Dad, no one measures up to you. Or something like that. Or you could put, um, we love you, Dad, and like put the kids' names. So I love this idea. So it's a tape measure, 25 feet long. This is great too. Y'all, I'll grab two of these. <laughs> one you give to your dad, your spouse, your brother, whoever. And then I got one for me. That way I can keep this with my stuff. <laughs> that way I don't have to go out to the garage and dig through my husband's stuff. I can have my own tape measure. And then of course, to go with all that, a, <laughs> a toolbox. So, all right, so I love the idea of personalizing these. But not all of us have a Cricut. Not all of us have like a wood burning tool or whatever you would use. So my thought was, I went over to the Crafter Square section and I found all of the dad stickers that I could find. So, this one right here, <laughs> I love it. You get eight of them, but look how cute these are. You got all those stickers. Um, but the one on here, this one right here, it says, Mr. Fix-It Guaranteed. How cute would it be to take any of these stickers and put it right there on the center of that, that, um, of that tape measure. Now, you can Mod Podge these on here. You could just stick it on there just as the gift. But something like that, I think is a great idea. So these right here, y'all, these are so cute. World's best dad. And look, it's like the old timey strong man. This is right here. If you have like a baseball loving guy in your family, this. A lot of these are great. These are really nice looking. Uh, this one right here. Um, you get nine of these. This one you get eight. You get world's greatest dad, cool dad, best dad ever. That is a great size to stick onto here. Uh, they have grandpa wins and I love. Um, they had grandpa wins. No, but you could also use these as dad because it's got go fishing, golf clubs, family man, time together with that old, um, with like an old pocket watch. Those are really great. Um, <laughs> this one is like, kind of like the pub type thing. You've got pool table, you've got darts, you've got beers. I like that one. And then this one is decorative stickers, crafter square section, but they're different. See those? Now, oh wow, look at that. It's a clear backing. See, hey, that's what they look like, but it's clear. So I am curious. All right, so this, <laughs> I thought I could just like peel this off really quick. It's not that easy, but I could, I could work with it. I could take some fingernail polish remover or something to it. And I can get that off. But one of these added onto here. Alright. This sticker right here. I feel like this is like a really good size. So I'm just gonna peel this off. I'm gonna stick it onto this tape measure really quick just to even see what it would look like. Look. Y'all, seriously! That if this one right here covers that opening perfectly. 
Look at that. Now, if you wanted Mod Podge that on there, put your little coating over it. Um, now, I will say, if this is something they throw in and out of a, a tool bag all day, that's going to end up getting scratched up. But if it's just something that they have, they kind of measure here and there, or if they're like my husband, and anything the kids give them, it's so sentimental, he would love this. So, <laughs> I just think that's a great idea. I think that Mr. Fix-It is great for like the tape measure. You would just have to get that sticker off first. So yeah, so when you go to Dollar Tree, check out all the stickers because that right there is adorable. Best dad ever. Also, Dollar Tree cards. I always get all my cards at Dollar Tree, but they can also make really cute decorations. To me, I like to go with like the tool stuff. I found this card, look. Look how perfect that is. It just says, thank you, dad. Um, and it's got like all the tools on the front. So to me, like um, if you're making a gift basket, you could have this kind of like popping up out of it and just adds a little something else to your gift. So this one right here, I love this one because it's going to match any of the gift baskets that we do. So you got that? I love the look of it. That one, this one right here too. Number one dad with the trophy. That would look cute, pop you onto a gift basket. All right, our next gift basket is for those like special fur dads. So like one of my dear friends, she, for Mother's Day, she always gets a little gift basket or a gift from like, from her fur baby. So I thought, you know, the dads, they need a little something too. So Dollar Tree has the cutest pet storage bin. I already have one for Bailey, but this one right here, look how adorable this is. So you get one of these, or any little basket, and we're gonna fill this up for the fur dad. That, it's got the paw prints and the little bones on it. Yep. A little bow. <laughs> and this may be kinda be more for the pets, but we're gonna add to it. But you got a cute little dog bow, and it says wolf. You put something like that. And we're all constantly pet, love on our animals. It's a pet grooming mitt. And it's got little bones on it. As you're petting your fur baby, you're also brushing them. That right there. Like a new little leash to kind of keep in the car or something. And I got, they had several different colors. I just grabbed this navy with the gray. And it's five feet long. So I just grabbed this one right here. Um, a little toy. Get him some toys. Dollar Tree has some great dog toys. And we all love to play with our pets. That right there. All right, <laughs> so as we're taking their pets out for a walk, y'all, this right here is new. So this right here is a dog waste bag dispenser, but it has hand sanitizer. That is great. Riley walks Bailey every single day, um, and of course he has to pick up after her. Well, this right here, it comes with the wipe. You know, it comes with your little bags, but this right here, you fill it up with hand sanitizer. So that way, after you pick up everything, you can like clean your hands off. That is a great idea. So this right here, um, so they had the blue, they had a green, and I think they had gray. I got this. Um, and then this one right here, same thing, but it has a flashlight. Uh, where is the flashlight? Right there. That right there is the flashlight of it. And it comes with a little waste bags. And then <laughs> extra waste bags. That, um, as we're walking, especially in the summertime, it's a little collapsible bow for your dogs. That way when you're on a walk with your pet, you have your water for you and you can pour a little bit of water into here. That way your dog can have some water too. And it folds, it collapses flat. So that is really great. And the best thing is it, um, it collapses flat. It has a carabiner, that right there. That way you can hook it onto the leash as you're walking. But you, like with that, because that is a lot of dog stuff, you could add any gift card. You know, get you, get a gift card to like their favorite store, favorite restaurants, Lowe's, Home Depot, wherever, and kind of tuck that, that down in there too. So I just happen to have some gift cards around here. But yeah, add these to their gift. So another like easy little gift idea that I have, y'all, they have some really great coffee mugs right now. Look at this one. Best dad ever. I love it. Double-sided. I love this mug. 
That is so great. This and y'all, they have name brand, a huge name brand, Jim Beam Bourbon Vanilla Coffee. My husband is gonna love to try this right here. <laughs> loves bourbon, we're, we're Kentucky, he loves his bourbon. But it's bourbon vanilla, four ounces. Get this, put it down into like a cute little coffee mug. You could also um, gift card, add your gift card to here. We have a Top Golf one. You add some Top Golf, Lowe's, Home Depot, Walmart, Target, wherever they love to shop. Add your gift card to it. So I love this idea. Also, they have a huge beer mug. <laughs> Y'all, this is a super heavy duty. This is heavy. This is solid, heavy duty glass. And how nice is that? Put it in the freezer, get it all chilled up for that ice cold beer. Look at that, that is nice. Root beer, whatever. That is really great. So with this, once again, you could, you could do a gift card. So like with this, I grabbed some teriyaki. I grabbed some beef jerky, the teriyaki flavored. I grabbed a couple of these. Um, some combos, like the pizza flavored. Some Gardettos. I got some sunflower seeds. This right here, name brand, Blue Diamond Almonds, but they're flavored. This is Extreme Carolina, Carolina Reaper. So y'all, these are supposed to be like spicy. That one. And then this one is Extreme Ghost Pepper. <laughs> I've never had a ghost pepper, but I've heard horror stories about them. So, <laughs> if you have someone in your life that likes spicy stuff, this would be a really cute add-on. Um, and like I said, when we're kind of done, I'll either, I don't know if I'm going to do another video or if I'll just do it and then show you. But all of this together would be a great little um, gift idea. Oh, and I have a really cute idea to add to this. So, that will be like maybe at the end or something. You know what? I'm going to show you right now. <laughs> Because <laughs> who knows with me what I'm going to do. So, Jimmy, for this beer mug, I love this. My thought was the yellow shred to make it look like beer. The yellow shred and then some white shred for like the foam topping of it. <laughs> Got the foam. Yeah, foam. Is that what it is? The white stuff. You know, the white. The foamy stuff that comes out of the beer. Whatever. But I thought that would be really cute to make it look like it's full of beer. Two, a gift basket idea for dad. Dollar Tree right now has those huge tubs. These totes right here, they've got red, they've got white, blue, gray. There's several different colors at Dollar Tree. And this is a really great size. You can load this up with a lot of stuff if you wanted. All right, we're on our last gift basket idea. Y'all, I went crazy. <laughs> I have so much stuff right here because my husband loves to grill out. We have, we have a smoker, so we're always outside cooking out something. My brother loves to cook out. One of my brother-in-laws loves to cook out. He has a smoker. So it's like this stuff right here really like hit home with me. So I kind of got excited getting all this stuff, especially for $1.25. All right, so once again, I'm going to show you like when we're done, However, everything put together. But for now, I'm just gonna reach in here, grab stuff to show you. All right, so for like a Father's Day cookout, backyard barbecue gift basket, um, seasonings. You cannot go wrong with Dollar Tree seasonings because they have name brand. Kingsford, that is a huge, um, that is a huge name brand, especially like cooking out. They had Kingsford lemon pepper, and a Cajun style spicy Louisiana classic seasonings. Right there. This is a great add on to a Father's Day gift basket. Those. And then this. I love this stuff right here. Um, Kelowna, Kelana, I'm not sure how you say it, but gourmet burger. Every time we cook out, like for doing burgers, I put this on our cheeseburgers. Gourmet burger and gourmet. Beer canned chicken. 
These are a great add-on. Another great thing to add to it, pickles. Oh, Dollar Tree has pickles and they're good. I bought them before. Look at these. So you got the sandwich slicers. I love these. There's a long, flat, skinny ones that you can add to like cheeseburgers, to cheeseburgers or sandwiches. And then they also have just the dill chips for burgers. These are gonna look great into a gift basket. Oh, and they also had Dad's barbecue socks. <laughs> look how cute. These are right here. I love those. I thought these were like a perfect find to go with this. All right, All right this right here is just a fun thing. Um, dilly baskets, and you get four of them. This to me is so like old school, classic. You can put the little wrappers down in here, put your, um, your cheeseburger and french fries or hot dogs and french fries, brats, kind of whatever. Onion rings. I just thought this was great. So this right here. And then this right here is classic. A corn, it's a corn on the cob tray. You get four of them. That right there. Love these. Um, your fresh, like your hot corn on the cob, put your thing of butter down inside here. You put your corn, sprinkle a little bit of salt. And then as the butter melts, you can twist and rotate your, your corn on it. That way it gets all good and buttery. These are great. A lighter. One of these butane lighters. Classic. If you're lighting a, a grill, or for you if you're lighting candles in the house. <laughs> One of these is great to have on hand. And then skewers. Bamboo skewers. You get a hundred. So these are great for doing like shish kebabs. We did shrimp on our smoker one night and we just put the shrimp through these. It was perfect. But I do recommend before you use them, let these soak in water for like a half hour before you put them on your grill. Cause it is wood. <laughs> so those, I thought this was a great little find, especially for Father's Day. Look, a Coca-Cola sun. But this would be really cute added to a gift basket, especially if your dad or husband, whoever, has like a man cage, like the garage, um, game room. This would be really cute in a game room. So it says, um, Coca-Cola, drink it ice cold for sparkling refreshment. That is great. I mean, Coca-Cola is just a classic type thing. Oh, and for your corn on the cob, they have corn holders. These are great. Yeah, you, know, you take these, you take two of them, one each end of your corn, and then you put it in that little tray and you can rotate without burning your fingers and then you just hold it and eat your corn. So these are great to have. And you get eight. So another great idea, they have a hamburger patty press. This, great, this is great, you put your meat in here. Let's open this up. <laughs> I didn't open it. Yeah, so you put your meat in here, you take your little press and you, you push it and squeeze it and you can make your hamburgers, your hamburger patty as thick as you want. You know, you can like really get them really thin for like kind of like that smash burger. So I thought this was really great. Another great add on to your gift is some oven mitts. But look, <laughs> how great is that? That way like if they are cooking out and they're bringing in like a hot tray or something, Right here, and it's got the grill on it. I love that. So it says, summertime cocktails and backyard barbecue, food, family, and good times. So I love that. Um, this one says grilling and chilling. <laughs> That's really cute. You've got the grill, you've got some ketchup and mustard and peppers. Love that one. This one, I love this. Uh, code drinks, good eats, and barbecue. That one. Now that is great to add to any gift. All right, this right here is also a great find. Oh, I love these. We have some of these for camping. These are great. We use these for camping, like when you're sitting around a bonfire. Um, it, it extends to 30 inches. These are great for like roasting hot dogs, brats, marshmallows, kind of whatever. This is a great gift idea. <laughs> I got 
have more stuff. I gotta bring it over. All right, so that classic kind of feel. They've got the waxed basket liners. I love these. These right here, added to these little baskets. Y'all, that just screams like 70s, 80s and stuff to me. That, um, a food tent. <laughs> we all need this in the summertime for all the flies and stuff, the bees, mainly the flies. If like you're cooking out and the flies all come around, cover up your food with these right here. Yep, I just thought this was really cute. They have a new barbecue mat. Look how cute that is. It's a placemat, but I thought this was really cute. Um, Especially if you have like an outside like grilling area. Maybe like sit this out there and like put all your condiments on it. All right, so when you're cooking out, you gotta have all the, the tools and stuff for it. So I grabbed a spatula. Great deal, $1.25. That, they have tongs for like your chicken and hot dogs. Right here. And then this I thought was great. It's like a two in one. You've got like the hamburger spatula but you also have the tongs. <laughs> you know what? I want to open this up really quick because I want to see this. Yeah, look. <laughs> it opens. It's tongs. Y'all, that is great. Have you ever tried to get something off the grill as you're trying to get it? It's just rolling and like sometimes it'll fall down into the charcoal or something. <laughs> I know I've done it. But this, you can like scoop it but also like pinch it at the same time. So I thought that right there. That's a great gift. Oh, another great name brand find to add to your gift. They have Kingsford baked beans and it's brown sugar molasses. Wow, <laughs> I love that. And you can uh, make this on Father's Day. Like you give it as a gift and then you like heat it up for like dinner that night. It's great. You know, you got 4th of July coming up, all the cookouts that's going to be happening. All right, I love this right here. It's a ketchup and mustard bottle, but let's open this. Because I think these would be cute opened up into your gift. But the yellow one says, cold drinks, good eats, and barbecue, which was the same thing that Blue Tao said. That is too cute. And the red one says, grill, eat, chill, repeat. <laughs> that is great, y'all. I love these. I think they'd be so cute to decorate with. <laughs> Seriously, like, get some for the man in your life and then get you a set to decorate with. I love it. And that's maybe what I'm going to do. That. All right, this, I've already bought one of these for my husband and we love it. It is a grill tray. It's like a baking sheet, kind of like a cookie sheet, but it's got the holes. That way uh, it can steam. Whatever you're cooking, the heat is getting up through everything. So y'all, this is great. We have one of these and I just grabbed another one because this is really good. And then also I figured you, know, you get all this grilling stuff, you might as well get you a grill cleaning brush. I buy these. I do not buy the ones that got like the little um, the bristles and stuff to them. I've heard horror stories about those. So I just get this foam. It's got the nice handle and you just scrub and clean your grill grate with this. So I grabbed some of the LA's totally awesome grill and oven cleaner. Cleans and degreases, tough on grease, and it shows a grill. This is a huge bottle. And that LA's totally awesome. That is some good, powerful stuff. I use it in our showers. So this is supposed to be for grills and ovens. Now, I have never bought this before. I have never used this before. So I cannot give you an honest recommendation on this, but I thought it was a great find. Like I said, I'm gonna give it to my husband and see what he thinks. But this is a huge bottle. How much? 40 ounces. My goodness. But this right here, along with like a grill cleaning brush, that's great. Some of my like favorite like gift baskets that I got to go with this. Um, another one of those, those totes. This is more of a navy color. I got this one. 
I got a huge red like solo cup. <laughs> Look how big this is. They also had a blue one, but to me the red, just like I start singing this song, Red Solo Cup by Toby Keith. <laughs> so I grabbed one of these. All right, the Dollar Tree I went to had the plus bonus section. I grabbed another one of my wooden crates. Y'all, I love these. We painted one up to look like the American flag. I love that, it's on our kitchen table, but I wanna like stain this one. So, but I thought this would be like a really great, fill this up with a lot of this barbecue stuff. That, and then also, oh, that was $5. Did I say that? Probably not. <laughs> $5. And then also, brand new that I found, look at this um, bucket. It's like a tin. Y'all, I love this right here. And after I'm done like gifting this, I'm going to decorate with this. <laughs> but look at that. It looks like an old wash tub. So I would love to figure out how to like distress this. Almost make it look kind of rusty or something looking. You know, like very like aged. But I thought this right here. Take this, some of that, um, this right here, that waxed paper, line this up in here, you know, fill this up with like some of these goodies and then put this down in here, like it's, it's tissue paper. But I thought these two together would be like a really cute decorating idea. Or decorating, <laughs> I'm decorating on my mind. Gift basket idea. Ooh, you know what? <laughs> Y'all. I'm constantly thinking, this feels just like tissue paper. This right here, it feels just like tissue paper. So yeah, look, that's a good size. Take it, kind of pop it. I thought kind of like adding it to this. Look how cute. Start adding like a little ketchup, a little mustard thing to it. I'm gonna make this look better. <laughs> but how cute that gonna be? And two, I'm telling you, when we're done with this, I always have like decorating on my mind. So I think a really cute table centerpiece, especially if you have like a deck or a patio, like that. Have your little ketchup, your little mustard, your seasonings, like if you're having a cookout, have it set out there, like your salt and pepper shakers. You could have like napkins and straws and all that down in here. But this would be a really cute centerpiece. <laughs> and I think we can do that. I really do think we can make this a really cute outdoors like centerpiece. Y'all, I have on the floor down here, I've got all kinds of tissue paper, all kinds of shreds and ribbons and bowls and all that kind of stuff. But I don't want this video to be too long. So I think I may just go ahead, put it all together, and I'll just like post the pictures right here, like a little video at the end, that way you can see it. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do a separate video or maybe our family vlog channel. Maybe we'll kind of put it on there. But that on there is more <laughs> silliness, you know? So, um, but regardless, I'm gonna get these together and I'm gonna show you my ideas. But haul wise, that is it. Like I said, we have a cart full of stuff, as you can probably tell. Um, but just in case this is the last time you're watching, I just want to wish any dads out there a happy Father's Day. Um, the fur dads, happy Father's Day to you. And also, to all of those incredible, strong mamas out there who play the role of both mom and dad, happy Father's Day to you. <laughs> I always get choked up. <laughs> so, my brother and I, we were raised by one of those incredible moms who was our mom and our dad. I love my dad. I do. I love my dad. Um... But my brother and I, we were raised by one of those strong, independent, always there for us, no matter what we needed, she was there. You know, she worked so hard and struggled to, to give us everything that we needed. Um, so, <laughs> so every Father's Day, we would call her and wish her a happy Father's Day. <laughs> um, Mother's Day and Father's Day. So I know there's a lot of you mamas out there that's doing the exact same thing for your kids. So... Happy Father's Day to you too. <laughs> but all right, enough of me rambling. We are still gonna have our Dollar Tree Friday. This was just like the Father's Day special. <laughs> but we will have our Dollar Tree Friday haul. Um, also, we did some patriotic 
crafts together. My video would not upload. It was supposed to go up yesterday midnight. It took six hours for that thing to finally upload. So at midnight last night, it was way too late. Plus this video is today, we we'll have Dollar Tree Friday. So on Saturday, I will post our new patriotic DIY video together. But all right, bye guys. Thanks for watching. All right y'all, really quick, I am so sorry. The gift baskets will be in tomorrow's video, Friday's Dollar Tree haul. This day has completely got away from me. Um, so the gift baskets, if you're interested in seeing them, will be in Dollar <laughs> Friday's Dollar Tree haul. So I am so sorry about that.